five Zacks. On all five Zacks. Are there enough Blade of the Rune Kings Ooh. to go through that? I mean, Giant Slayer into uh, Lord Dominic's is going to be critical for just about everybody in this game. It certainly is. You could definitely expect the Zacks to be picking up their uh, Spirit Visages. You can see the uh, different builds coming out from Zacks here. I mean, not really. <laughs> All Doran's <laughs> shields coming out from every single Zack. Uh, you see Kami in mid lane only using his health potion. Only Revolta really going for the Hunter's Talisman to kind of farm up in the jungle a little bit more efficiently. Whereas for the Ezreal's receive support Ezreal being played by Rosie. He's gone for the Spell Feast Blade just to kind of not take any farm away from Radiant. Going for a traditional AD carry Ezreal. Top lane swipe has got his Doran's Blade. Mid lane we have a Doran's Ring for Swiffer. PBO and Dude are really struggling in this bottom <laughs> lane. They've got eight CS between them. I don't know why one of them... But so when we were when we were uh, watching the playtest earlier, like people went double relic shield. I'm surprised that we didn't see the same thing come out. Uh, Yang, gotta be careful in that top side. Taking quite a bit of damage there from Carbot and Swiper, but is able to get to the safety of his turret. Does have teleport if he needs to get back into his lane. Uh, in fact, Kami's already used his teleport to get back into the mid lane, picked up a Ruby Crystal for himself. Yang still deciding to say, Carbon and Arkham shifts forward, gets a little bit of damage down on toward the Zack Swiper, threading the needle with his Mystic Shots as well. Infernal Drake is the first one out on the map, so maybe we'll end up seeing if... I mean, if the Ezreals can get that off, just having the natural push advantage in the lanes, then that, that's going to go, you know, a nice little way, help him chunk through some of the, the health that Zacks are going to end up with. I wonder whether we're going to see a full AP Zack <laughs> coming from that, or whether they're all just going to build help. I'm actually really curious to see if we're going to see a full tank Ezreal from Swiper, because when he played the Assassin's mode Pantheon, he tried to build pseudo tank, didn't really go for an Assassin's build, uh, lacked a lot of damage on his Pantheon top, and he is known to be a top lane tank player. I don't know how effective tank Ezreal is going to be against five tanks. <laughs> well, that is actually something I have seen in a competitive game. <laughs> Top lane tank Ezreal. Uh, not very exciting. You just arcane shift into people and hope you don't die. Ah. <laughs> I would assume if, uh, if you have a lot of resistances, you're probably not going to die. But... Ah, oh, Yang. Didn't quite find Swiper. He's going tier. He's not, not really going tank on this one. Not going to go tank. Meanwhile, Swiffer heads back into his... Uh, mid lane picked up a tome for himself, so sticking to a true AP Ezreal build path. You can see he's got a lot of points into his Essence Flux instead of the Mystic Shock, which does scale a lot better on AP. Dude going to take a bit of damage from the Thunderlord's proc by Rosie there. Rosie and Radiant actually doing a really good job in this bottom lane. It's 46 CS to 13 at the moment. See, the other side of things from that uh, the last chapter, Mm -hmm. We're going to go Morel and Armacon, so we're going to have some of that healing reduction coming through. Maybe we'll see one mortal reminder out of some of the other Ezreals, just to cut through some of the self-healing that Zach's going to have too. So uh, it's not just the Lord Dominic's. You kind of probably need a mix of both. Ooh, dude, got to be careful. Take quite a bit of damage there, but Revolta's trying to jump in across the side of the oh, wall. Can see if he can it? land it. Nope. Decides to cancel his Elastic Slay. So it's due, just taking so much damage from the Essence Fluxes over the minion wave from Radio and Rosie. Yeah, and it's, you know, a difficult time because as soon as you see Zack come in, that Arcane Shift's going to just jump you right the way out of danger. So, do you this time, he comes onto the mini wave. Uh, that's going to spell the end of that push from the Ezreals in the bottom side. We'll see what they end up buying. It seems like every single Zack is going more for tanky items. as a oh. true shot barrage down the mid lane. There's Everybody's high health, through. so we're not we're not following it for a kill, unfortunately. Yep, just um, seems like uh, Carbon there decided to tax Swiffer's lane a little bit, despite not ganking it. Just getting that constant push on. Make sure you can push every lane out as much as possible. Where are PBO and Dude going? Seems like they're moving in towards the red buff here. Carbon's actually started that one up. Does have a ward inside of his own brush, so can spot out the Zacks coming through. Oh, mid lane. Kami trying to jump on top of Swift. Oh, he shifts forward. Another one comes in with Revolta. They're bouncing on top of the Demon Ezreal. Double bounces all over Swift. <laughs> they will splash down and pick up first blood. Oh, Dude. The first Blobbers are going to get popped there. The rest of the team, they're PBO to and Revolta, are trying to block. There's only one block they left, but it. no, oh. it's not going to be enough. Dude, the French dude will get taken down. PBO having a flash out. They missed a couple of critical blocks 
on the cues coming from the Ezreal. So one to one, uh, the advantage is for the OPL team right now because just the sheer farm advantage in the bottom lane. Here he's so up on the top side of the map there. Yang trying to go aggressive over towards Swiper. True Shot Barrage comes across the map. Doesn't take the red buff away from Revolta. He picks that one up with ease. Kappa now working on the Scuttle Crab. Honey, do even being picked up there. Rosie making sure Kappa's nice and topped up. They're going to start the Infernal Drink. Should be able to chip away at this one pretty quickly as three Estrels. Okay, that's <laughs> it's fluxing one another to keep their attack speed nice and high. Oh, that's... Uh, you scratch my back, I'll scratch yours. Uh, everybody gets the extra attack speed. And they're able to take that down. Let's take another look at how Swiffer got taken out because there's the one. Didn't quite hit from Kami, so baits out the E. I like it. Kami missed on purpose by the looks of it. <laughs> was able to bait Swiffer forward. Uh, I'll give him the benefit of the doubt on that one. Come on, Revolta, you've got to block the cues here. He's, he's a little bit afraid because Rosie and Radia are both there, and they just don't block the damage coming through. BBO even tried to block the last few attacks there for Dude, but he gets taken out afterwards as well. Kami, he's gone back to base, picked up a Negatron Cloak for himself. So possible, possibly still going for that Pistol Scepter. We'll have to see if this does decide to go for the AP Zack. A Swiper gets jumped on here by Yang. Gonna miss his own mystic shots, trying to farm up as much as possible, but he only has the tier, so it doesn't deal too much damage to Yang in the top lane. Yeah, Yang just healing up more off the blobs that are on the floor than uh, the damage that, uh, that Swiper's doing to him, man. Revolta picks up a blue. Is he gonna head bot side? Actually, just goes straight onto Gromp, so no real help for his bot lane. <laughs> BBO and Dude. Con the double bounce. Constantly just trying to jump onto the minion wave, clear that one out, and then you see two arcane shifts forward from Radiant and Rosie, trying to capitalize on that one. Now it's just an army <laughs> of Zacks lining up. The rain of Slingshot Barrages could be coming out of just a bit here. Radiant and Rosie have to be careful. I want to see this. The th the just everybody elastic slingshotting. Ah, oh, they're moving. Oh. That would have been fun. Oh. Would have been epic to watch, but instead the Oceanic bottom lane heads back to base. Swiffer throws out a true shot barrage, looking to try and clear out the mid lane. Kami is still here, nice and healthy. He's picked up a chain fest for himself. Yeah. Is he going GA first? Is that, are they all going GA first? After the, oh, the no. Sunfire Cape. They've parts. got Kami okay. Cinders. <laughs> yeah, well, that's okay. Kami is going GA by the looks of it. Um, that would be very obvious. If they all get Guardian Angel. That's 15 Zacks, basically, that you have to kill. Pretty much. That's disgusting. <laughs> you thought killing Zack twice was hard enough, and they all have teleport as well, so they can keep each other invulnerable during one of their resurrections. Oh, wow, I hadn't... Yeah, that's... Not great. <laughs> Carbon again throwing out his true shot barrage towards the mid lane, taxiing Swiffer again. Uh, being from rival teams in Oceania, you know, just throwing a little bit of shade in the mid lane. Kami still looking to see if he can farm up here against Swiffer. going to be jumping in from Fogger Ward. Doesn't connect with the knockup. Good see, arcane shift. That's what's going to happen if you if you try and hit the first one. Kami needs to miss the first one and then bait him forward again. Although I don't think Swiffer's going to have that happen too often. Uh, however, you can see the cooldown is enough that Kami just gets right back to the elastic sync shot. See so far all the Zacks going as tanky as possible. Cinder Hulk being picked up by Revolta. He's trying bot again. again. He's trying to get into get the bottom lane. PBO is oh. looking for the bounce. Revolta's coming in as well. They both don't connect. So close. Not able to get the knockups down, and Radiant Rose just poked them back. It's like watching diving at the Olympics at this <laughs> point. That one, not a good dive. There was no synchro to it. The spin was off, entry was bad. 2.5 out of 10. <laughs> That'd be a really low score. <laughs> it's Swiper and Yang going toe-to-toe -to -toe here. Courage and Colossus does get popped. Oh, well, they're now going to try and jump in. They try to predict the arcade ship, but only one gets it. Now they're bouncing oh, on they the bottom lane. But oh, they takes so way much. too much damage. There go the Blobbers. The Teleport's going to come in to try and keep him alive, but that's not a very low health Blobbler. True Shot Barrage does come out. Yang, we're going to keep him alive. He's on top of Carbon, forced to use the heal. He's bouncing on top of him. He now gets split. Quick. There's one dude, Teleport. Dude, there he, he go. does. He teleports onto it. Dude's going to try and save the day. Yang comes back up. Teleport gets oh. killed. 
But Radiant still picks up the kill. Oh, dude, couldn't keep him alive. Tried to, but uh, he's going back in for more. Yeah, dude is a real man here for Team Fire. Keeps jumping back in. It's now 2,000 gold leads though for the OPL squad. So Kami did not go for a Guardian Angel first. <laughs> Kami has gone for a ZZ Rock Bottle first. So he's just trying know. to counteract some of that push. I don't know what's, what's worse, to be honest. <laughs> I don't know if I want to see the uh, little rhinoceroses that Max likes to affectionately call them, or uh, 15 Zacks. They both so, just uh, don't sound great. This was the attempted Zack attack in the bottom lane. PBO missed, Diud missed, Revolta missed. Great sequence. That was fantastic. <laughs> That's... Here comes the first TP, so this was uh, Yang come from the top lane. Unfortunately, gets taken pretty low, can't even quite get on for the first kill, and Carbon survived. Then Dude, you can see on screen, <laughs> tries to TP through. <laughs> Yang doesn't have enough health when he comes back. Uh, it was good in theory. Oh no, the Rhinoceroses are back. Jumanji! Gets the push. Get the turn! Look at it go! Oh. Almost got there. It was almost a little beetle that could. It's very rare, rare that we see a ZZ Rock portal in the mid lane. Yes, it actually is. That's incredibly a pretty, rare. Pretty short lanes. So it's going to be able to get towards the turrets quite quick here, but now Swiffer and Rosie are both in that mid lane. Kami, we're going to see if we get the bounce going on in the mid lane. Oh. Said just jumps on towards the mini lane, tries to get a clear, but here comes the rest. Dude's now going to jump in. Arcade okay, shifts galore, and finally Revolta yeah, will be able to knock off Kami. The bounces are going down. It's splashdown <laughs> time for the Zags. As they're able to knock the Debonair Ezreal's around, Rosie and Swiffer just watch helplessly as Karma gets taken down. Oh, it's almost like a celebration as soon as they hit the first <laughs> E. Every Zach goes, get him! <laughs> we got it, boys, out. let's go! <laughs> oh, that was, that was hilarious. Well, it ties up the scoreboard. It's 2-2, and it's still a three close to four... No, sorry, 3,000 gold advantage for the OPL team. Majority coming from the CS discrepancy in the bottom lane. Here's that one more time. <laughs> so, as is customary, missed the first one. Missed the second one. Got it! Gets the third one, and off they go. They're off. <laughs> He's oh, not going to find Radio as well. He's going to get knocked up. The second one, Revolta predicts the arcade ship for Radio. Trying to chase him down. Use as much rubber hands as he can and will take down the 80k from Oceania. <laughs> that was great. Oh, it looked like Radio couldn't quite get away from that one. Tried, I guess didn't have his E up by the time we got there and uh, completely shut out. So Yang has to deal with Carbon. <laughs> Throws down the smite as well, just for a little bit of extra damage. I don't know what's going on anymore in this game. <laughs> this, this is silly. Well, Swiper's built a stinger up at the top lane. Uh, not a very traditional item for Ezreal. Uh, going for that Trinity Force. So just putting it in with the rest of the build, so we'll be able to get that max damage. This is... No. Sounds no. awful. <laughs> It's like the Dragon Pits their own little swimming pool and they're just diving in constantly. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know he tickles the underbelly of the fish. <laughs> I've never watched that recall fully. Oh no. Well, Swiffer on the top side, uh, sorry, Swiper on the top side of map, still pushing out against Yang here. He's doing a really good job of holding his own. Oh no, look at. Look oh, at the inventories. No, there's look, Raptors cloak for look both what's coming. Revolta the and Dude. ZZ Rock portals in every lane. ZZ Rock portals and Sunfire capes galore. And then buy the GAs, because then you'll never die. GA and Spirit Resurgent, they'll all be safe. One, Arkan Shift for years. Carbon, Carbon still gets hit by the next bounce. Whiffer now trying to jump away. Revolta and Yang on top of him. bouncing! Swiffer, he's gonna get knocked down here. They flatten him like Super Mario. Oh man, this is the kind of game where I feel bad for our observers because they're gonna try and catch every single elastic slingshot. <laughs> here comes some in the middle. Oh, Kami's going in first. Swiper uses arcade shift. Now that's a good target for Doom, but he can't connect. 
Duncan said, takes quite a bit of damage from the double Ezreal in the mid lane. So Kami's easy route portal is doing a decent job of at least holding back that mid lane, stopping the push for as long as possible. And we started to close some of the gold lead that uh, the OPL team had. Take me coming through onto the ZZ Rob portal. Uh, All right, Kami. What do you have in store for us this time? <laughs> gonna get into lane. Yep, just clears up the minions. Bounces yep. all over the place. Perfect dive. Gets onto it. Gets so now, the front minions. Now we can kind of see the staggering the jumps, making sure the arcane shifts are used. I'm actually just surprised Kami hasn't gone full AP and he's, he's the last person to jump in. I am a little surprised on that. Like, get Luden's Echo or something so that when you jump in and you hit them, you particles bounce everywhere, Zack <laughs> bounces everywhere. Not Swiffer. Quick to Arcane shift out of that one. Yang will take a little bit of damage. But he's fine. He's Zack. He's very, very tanky. Second ZZ Rob portal. Oh, and it's going to be the jungle that picks it up. Revolta. And there's two more in the making here. Both Yang <laughs> as well as Dude have the components. They've got the Raptor's Cloak ready to go. <laughs> this, this game. I, I don't know whether this game is ever going to end because I don't think the Zacks can ever catch Ezreal. Buckle up, everyone. Quick we're going enough. to 60 minutes. I legitimately <laughs> think we're going long on this one because Zack can never catch Ezreal enough to reliably kill all of them. But with five ZZ Rock portals, can Ezreal push the wave back? Oh. Unless they like ult one wave continually, all of them every single time, um, this might be a bit of a stalemate. It's gonna be Have we got a difficult. few more play-by-play -play casters? <laughs> <here? laughs> <laughs> just, just bring five in and we'll just keep everybody fresh. Oh, Swift has been jumped on here, tries to shift away. Revolta will pop the left bounce, but the flash will get some for back to safety. I legitimately think this is a game of like, OPL have to just wait and win in the late game. Um, uh, six items or bust? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fish, is your voice up to this? <laughs> well, we'll see how this one goes. For now, though, there's still lots of bouncing going on in the top lane. Swift has been jumped on. No more flash available for him. Rosie's now getting under the water, see if he can help him out. The last shift's going through. The rubber hands are there. Revolta is unstoppable. You can see Swift has his hands in his head. Have the three Zacks jump him in the top lane. Meanwhile, Kami trying to defend his mid lane out to the turret, but Swiper and Carbon are enough to take that one down. All of that for one Ezreal, and they lose their mid tower at the same time, so that's going to speed the game up uh, just a touch. TP coming in. They're trying to go on the bot side. Oh, Radia. Radia is being bounced on by PBO. Meanwhile, Revolta and Carbon are trying to duke it out, but there is a TP right behind Radia uh -oh. in the bottom lane. Kami, though, suicide squad in that mid lane. That's the flash of Way. Carbon's gonna flash board, try and get the slow down. They do kill the Zerot portal. As Revolta decides to jump in as well with his allies. Oh. Radius managed to somehow avoid the gank that came down to the bottom lane. Will Arcane shift over the wall? Three Zacks are not enough for Radius. Looked like he was trying to get a, uh, you know, the, the Zacks were trying to box him in but couldn't get it. Look at how much they used for Swiffer though. Bro. Yang, first to ult. Dude flashes on him and ults. Revolta comes in all the way from the back of the lane and. He's able to output some damage. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 same, Swiffer, same. <laughs> I think that's how we're all feeling watching this game. <laughs> Why? Why is the word that comes to mind? Oh, goodness. So two zero portals are online. Seems like the next two are coming up shortly. Uh, PBO didn't get the memo. Oh, he's, he's getting there. He's got the, the rejuvenation bead. You know, he, he's, he's on his way. Nearly. Slowly. It almost seems like they're in for the long haul as well. They're like, all right, let's get to six items. Be so tanky they can't kill us and just bounce on them. Uh, I don't know if that's going to be the case, but it seems like what Brazil are trying to do. Seems like it. Um, it's, it's a long waiting game till they get six items. See two executioners' callings being picked up. One by Carbon, one being picked up by Radia. We already have the Merlinomicon being picked up by Swiffer in the mid lane. Yeah, all to get through that healing. So eventually, we might want to see a Lord Dominix, but just stack the healing debuff as uh, frequently as possible. Kami now in the mid lane, going toe to toe against Swiffer. Just wants to clear out the wave. 
Combin has something to say about that. He's going to oh, get jumped Combin. on now. He's already using his ship. They're bouncing on him. The jungler from Oceania is just getting melted here. And it seems like as soon as Zach holds you tight, he's never going to let you go. Yeah, got to be careful because as soon as you use that shift away, if you're still in range, Yang's going to ult on you as well. Oh, there's all the bounces going on top of Swiper. Already used his shift. Oh, Yang's still chasing coming up, him Yang. down. There goes the jump. The flash away from Swiper. He's now going to go toe to toe. Let's see if he can get the damage he needs out towards Yang. True Shop Barrage does come out, left with less than 200 health. Swiper just doesn't have the Use mobility the to catch running. us. There's two ZZ Rami hits on the them. top lane. What's going on? Uh, Mountain Drake in the bottom side is what's happening. I mean, just using the double ZZ Rock minions as bodyguards. Oh, they've got four now, Stress. I don't think we can keep up with all these rhinoceros beetles. <laughs> oh, goodness. This... I, I mean, the, the bodyguard play, I, I like it. It's good. Kami dropping very low in the mid lane. And look, we're nearly at number five. We're nearly at number five on PBO. PBO, he wants to catch up with the rest of his team. Two ZZ Rock portals already in the top lane of Volta. Uh -oh. And Dude, looking for Swiper. He's already used his flash. They're just trying to get behind him, it seems. Dude, not quite far enough. He'll be able to defend the top lane turret to fight another day. It's so low, though. What he's got to do is run up to it. But he can't with three people up on the top side. He's, they're still hunting him. Swiper, be careful, Swiper. Don't, don't use your E. Swiper, no swiping. Come on. No swiping. Dude, now oh. trying to get behind Swiper. No fucking shift used, but Yang is here as well. Here we now go. the Beatles are charging on. <laughs> uh, one gets there. We'll be able to get a decent amount of damage down. Rosie pops the ghost. Spooky ghost will Two slow gone. down. Two of the Zacks. Just need the next minion wave. Try and push back Rosie. Here we go again. Dude looking for the charge. Again, still trying to push the top lane. We mentioned Zacks might have a bit of trouble pushing these turrets. Seems like they've found the solution here, Stress, which is every single Xerox portal possible. <laughs> Now. They're slowly chipping away at this one. Is it the ZZ Rock Ooh. minions that are guarding the Zacks, or the Zacks that are guarding the ZZ Rock minions at this point? Because they're just walking them into the tower. Oh no, there's even more in the bottom lane, slowly chipping away at these turrets. It's starting to look a little bit like the Lee Sin against, uh, Lee Sin against Graves match that we saw. No, this today. is looking nothing <laughs> like the Lee Sin versus Graves matchup. The Lee Sin versus Graves matchup was almost over at this point. <laughs> this feels like it hasn't even really begun. Kami now going for the let's bounce on top of Swiper, but Swiffer's down here as oh, well. He'll shoot Swiffer. into the bounce. Swiper now going aggressively forward, trying to get as much damage down as possible. Kami Wait sidesteps a couple. Of the Mystic Shots, the but TPs ready. are ready. Oh, no. All of them are ready. As soon as you pop one of these Zacks, all four Ooh, are going to show up gonna fall. Soon. afterwards. Eventually, they do have more uh, ZZ Rock portals in the mid lane. But it's going to be the top tower, I feel, that will fall first. Dude and yeah. Yang have pushed them off. The Beatles are charging on forward, and they're going to be able to take this one down. Oh, PBO. PBO taking a lot of damage. Step. PBO, he's going to fall first. His passive gets popped. Revolta's there to save the day. They can't kill to the him. top of Carmen. He's been separated from his team. They can't kill PBO, and it's going to be Carmen that falls first. The rest of the Ezreal have to shift the heck out of there. This is like playing against a mortar of Zacks right now, just coming in from all angles. Oh. The double TP. They're oh, it's onto the, the bombs. bombs. Yang's going to be careful, Yang alive. Oh. He's still going to fall. I thought they kept him alive. They didn't come Complete the TP. Oh, PBO, dude. I thought it was enough. I thought they were going to arrive. I thought they were going to save the day. They were trying to be friends, but uh, just didn't quite work out. Meanwhile, uh, someone in the back of this pitch just died to Baron and lost his passive. <laughs> Not sure which one that is. Now, I wonder, we've seen it a couple of times. Is it that they're cancelling the TP? So is it, or is it when Yang comes back alive that... You, you just can't, you're not TPing anymore, right? Because it used to be like Javan Flag and Thresh Lantern, even if the Lantern disappeared, you would still complete the TP onto it. So I assume it's the same thing. I gotta admit, this is where my uh, analysis fails because I'm not used to seeing Zack with Zack. Oh, I feel like they're cancelling it, but one that doesn't get cancelled oh. is Yang who knocks it back man. with the blast code! Over the wall for the alley -oop for Revolta! Uh, the Fire Flower comes out. Lots of bouncing in this game. <sighs> Difficult to keep up with everything. So this was PBO going on to Carbon, uh, or was it Carbon going on to PBO? Again, he shifts forward, does not expect 
that when his E is not available, the rest of the uh, Swiper's dead. Meanwhile, Kami just destroying Swiper, slaps him one more time with his rubber hands. He's gonna get taken down. It's now three to nine in favor of the CB All team. They've tied up the gold disadvantage they previously had. Kami's pushing. He's getting the tower. The damage is on. With the CZ Raw minions, finally they push another tower. And the inevitable whittling down with two Mountain Drakes and five CZ Raw portals. Zack is on the move. Well, the Man Immunes have been picked up by three members of Oceania. Aegis of the Legion actually being picked up by Rosie. Uh, that doesn't give your team armor or magic resist anymore, buddy. You're going to have to upgrade that into the locket first. <laughs> he just wants it for himself for now, by the looks of it. Oh. Kami taking a lot of, uh, getting a lot of damage down towards Carbon. Radius on the wrong side of the match. They're bouncing all over him. Second knockup's going to come who? The rubber hands are going to be able to slow him down. One more attack's going to oh. be enough. Oh. He's so low. They jump. It's not enough. But a Sunfire Gate will pick it up for Dude. Oh, just not enough mobility for Radier. Swiffer goes on Revolta. Revolta, incredibly low. One more order attack would take him down, but let's bounce from PBO. He's going to soak up a lot of the damage. Blast Cone gets Revolta over towards the Dragon Pit, but they spot him out. He's now trying to jump away. Rosie can't snipe him off. He's going to have to try and avoid the True Shot Barrages if they do come out, but Rosie's still chasing on towards PBO. It's, it's all a distraction, Fish. Look at the top lane. Oh my goodness. Look at the top lane. Zach's pushing up there, two of them. Woo, two Zach's just trying to chip away at this turret. Yang and Dude slowly working on this one. They don't have the rhinoceroses because they're not quite close enough to chip away at this turret, but the rubber hands of the experiments will be as they take down the top lane in a turret. Taking it down. Zach slowly but surely whittling down. Uh, this is Kami going against Carbon. I think Carbon, does he shift? Okay, he shifts out this time, but still not enough to oh, take no. out. Kami. Yeah, I was going to say, Revolta goes back in on this one, so we didn't quite catch the start of it. Flashes right on top of him, and to add insult to injury, escapes on top of that. So we've got four Sunfire Capes being built, uh, being built. Cinder Hulk for the side of Revolta, so that kind of counts. Four, uh, five Zizirot portals, and now here come the Thorn Mails. It, was, <laughs> it, it wasn't a locket that uh, Rosie was looking for, ah. it's a banner. Because that's actually a, a significantly good way of dealing with Zack, because everything's basically magic. Yep, then they desperately need some way to deal with all the pushing that's coming up from these CZR portals. So basically, we're going to have five CZR portals against inevitably five banners of command. It actually is the uh, unstoppable force meets the irresistible object at Pretty this much. point. Oh, and three mountain dragons have been picked up by the CB LOL squad. Um, yeah, if they ever get their hands on these turrets, although they don't do quite much damage to start with, they're going to start to really hurt them. Meanwhile, in the mid lane, the rest of Team Fire looking to try and chip away at this mid lane outer turret. Swift is the only one there left to deal with them. They don't have very much magic resistance, but still, it takes a long time to cut through them. Radius being jumped on by two of the experiments. They're trying to bounce the flash! Oh, 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 flash Radius! The he jokes away! Oh. Yeah, he knows. He sniffs trouble, and Radius puts his hands in his head. Yang yeah, has a big smile oh, on his face. Nearly, nearly baited him out. Oh, that was that would have been so good if Radius had done that. That would have been great. <laughs> <laughs> right here, just typing in all chat. How did you know so quickly? <laughs> Good oh, reaction dear. from Yang there. Here's a replay of that one. Oh, we, yeah, we have to see that again. Oh, man. I mean, you can just watch. Radio was kiting back, coming back. It was so close. He was running. Is it that he fakes running? Ah, oh, that's... He baited flashes as well, but if only if it hadn't have been for those meddling kids. <laughs> yeah, at first he's like, it worked, it worked. There's some words I can't repeat in there, but <laughs> that was his thought process. Oh. Um, <laughs> couldn't lawyer his way out of that one, unfortunately. Definitely couldn't. He was caught red-handed by the cops there. No, couldn't really represent himself. That's still the CB LOL team. They've actually taken the gold lead here, Stress. It's now 53,000 to 50... Sorry, 53,000 gold to 50,000 gold in favor of CB LOL. Revolta's right behind Carbon here. Gonna have to be a little bit careful. Charges the elastic slingshot, but doesn't go through. Oh, we'll still get stunned up by Dude there, but does Arcane shift back to safety? Now, here comes Kami, and there goes Revolta! Gets the let's bounce down! Radius being jumped on! 
Here we go, take it down. Revolt is legendary. PBO is chasing on towards Carbon, throwing out the rubber hands. They slow him down. He has to shift away, but they're still going through. Revolt jumps. He sidesteps it, but he is able to get the unstable matter off and to take him down. Swift is the next target. Gets killed by the Sunfire Cape as Kami just walks alongside him. Oh, they may be looking very suave, but the Devonair Ezreal's right now are really struggling. Ooh, teleport coming on top of the minion just to keep the turret aggro onto an invulnerable minion that slowly the relax. The Speedles are taking them down. The Elastic Streets are going in. It's bounce down time. Team Fire on top of Swipe, but he's the next one to fall. Rosie's trying to run away, but he's already inside of his own base. RK shifts away from one. The passive pops from Zack, but it's going to be a double kill on over towards one of them. And the Ace, Ace comes Ace. down for CB LOL. The Ace comes through. Oh, the CB LOL team have just completely destroyed the OCE hopes in this game. Oh, first they barely catch Raid here, and it's just enough. The Let's Bounce has come through, and honestly, that's pretty much everything that sets up this fight. Oh, there's a Doctor Who quote that seemingly sums this up very well, is that water seems to always prevail. The erosion of the oceanic base has slowly but surely happened. Oh, time and time again, and now they really really are in a difficult situation. Oh my goodness. Look, the, look at these thorn mails. Look at five. Them. <laughs> five thorn mails being picked up. Five Z-Zero portals. A randuins for Kami in the mid lane. They just don't really care about Swiffer right now. He's the only AP Ezra in the squad. Gonna have to do a lot <laughs> more to try and get past this tanky Zack lineup. Uh, they don't even need the GAs at this point. I'm, I'm gonna, they're, they're done with that. They already don't die. <laughs> I'm just really impressed with the strategy that Brazil has come up going into this all for one game. There's a needlessly large rod oh, for there Revolta. We go, Revolta. Here we go. Finally getting some AP, some additional AP. Oh, PBO. Slingshot's coming out. PBO is gonna take a lot Carbon. of damage for that one. Carbon's still gonna get hit, but they're gonna go oh, down Carbon. to Bounce Town. Oh. He's gonna take a lot of damage. Dude will pick up that kill. Couldn't see him coming. Mm. Gets caught out. CB Lola is gonna push this one through. I don't think they're ever gonna attempt Baron because that is just gonna take far too long. Oh, they're gonna put down a couple of the zero portals very oh, close Revolta. to the base. Three of them! To be precise, being laid down here. Swiffer trying to move out to see if he can poke away at them, but there's just so many Zacks. The constant stream of minions. Oh, goodness. I'm pretty sure a teleport's going to come in shortly. One of them's gone back to base. Here we go. The teleport. Siege him up. They're looking for a revolt over the side. Lands on top of Rosie. Meanwhile, Radius being bouncing as well. Rosie being the force one to four. Swiper's trying to kite backwards. Radius being jumped on, bounced on by PBO. Swiffer going to get knocked up as well. They're trying to kite back, but look at the inhibitor turret. There's so many beetles chasing them down. Swiffer's going to get locked down. Gets flashed on by Ye. He's trying to flash away, but Revolta's there. Gets the Thunderlord's proc, and it's a double kill beat mixed up. Three. Oceanic Ezreal's have been taken down. So many, but they can't let it be because if they want to take this game, they have to just finish off Swiper and Carbon. Swiper's gonna fall. Yang gets courage of the Colossus. Stays alive. They're gonna take him down. It's an ace for CB LOL. That's and the, the game. And the Red Beetles are gonna charge in towards the Nexus. That's game for CB LOL. 23 to 3. They've taken down the Ezreal's. That was a ridiculous game it's not over yet they're actually incredibly low and rosie is up they're it's taking a long time <laughs> this is the slowest nexus kill ever and there are multiple champions in front of it they're using their rubber hands and eventually will slap away at the nexus and take it down they're laughing here they, they they've come up with an ingenious strategy and they're gonna be the winners of their match against oceania oh. Oh, that <laughs>